an indie developer came up to me and was like in the dms and he's like hey i want you to re review this game and i'm like um well this has never happened before Whoa. and so he sent me a, a free version of it so it's like the full game but he sent me like a steam key so i got this for free and i've never played it so i thought is it undertale 2 whoa dude no i can't turn this music down really is that not an option? Dude, I can't turn the music down. That's not good. The game won't let me turn down the volume. So I guess that's one criticism. And I haven't even started yet. This guy looks game. like Jax, I'm just now realizing. Yeah, he has the hair and everything. I Doubles. know, that's what I'm saying. It's literally Jax. It's funny because I saw the trailer for this game and I didn't make the connection until just now. Whoa, dude, Skylanders. Six right here. <laughs> Basically. Uh oh, dad's texting. You gotta grab tech pack, right? For a second I thought that was in Comic Sans and I was incredibly worried. <laughs> yeah. So this is like a 2.5D platformer, I guess. I don't know. I just died. What? What did I do? What did I do? I didn't do anything. How did I just die? Bruh. <laughs> What? Is there falling damage and like, Dude, there's falling damage, but it's so messed up. Walk to an edge, press down arrow. Bruh, I was trying to read. Walk into a wall to shift onto it. So this is basically like constant C, except I guess the background changes. I'm pressing the down, oh, down arrow. Yeah, you said oh. down arrow yourself. Look, I'm using WASD, so it was confusing. If you fall more than two blocks, you die. Basically. Can't go zoom around the entire map, yeah. level, stage. Huh. Alright. That was a good tutorial. Ah, uh, no. I just game-ended myself. Oh, I'm pressing S instead of the down arrow again. Why isn't there an option to just make it S? I don't- You game. know, you. I don't know if you can change it, but... Go this way, down. No, no, I'm gonna game end. Oh no, no, shoot. Gosh darn it. Well, uh, I'm supposed to go this way, okay. All right, I got the orb. Pro gamer. I am going to pro gamer mode. Sicko mode. Um, so I'm supposed to collect all the orbs, okay. Imagine if I drop down one block and then just die. It's kind of a bruh moment, it's like the definition. Oh, no, shoot. <laughs> Apparently this game was made in like 2011 and I'm like, what? Oh, crazy. pretty epic. Fun fact, I used to actually uh, do gaming videos and one of the games I used to play was Constant C. That's why I keep relating that game to this. And I missed the jump again. Where am I supposed to go? Maybe I'm going in the wrong direction. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm supposed to press space. You idiot. I don't know how long I'll play this game for, but I I thought I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> I mean, this is a fun game so far. I really haven't found any problems necessarily, except that you can't turn down the volume, which seems like a basic function that you should be able to do. But Also, this is a weird level. I don't know how to get past there. I'm just so confused. Where are the orbs? Okay, now and I'm on like level three and I'm already stuck. The compass leads up here. And there's nothing over there. What? What? I'm so confused. Oh, the orbs here. I do like this unique puzzle game though. You know it's a good puzzle game when you don't figure it out on the first try. No, I gotta, okay, I know what I need to do. Go this way, then I'm gonna drop down. What? Bruh, I was supposed to How am I supposed to get over there? Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? That's all I had to do? Wow, I didn't know I could actually do that. I guess I missed something in the tutorial. Oopsie. Well, that was my bad. I thought I could only use up and down, but apparently it's more than that. Can I do it in air? I don't believe I can. See, everything makes a lot more sense now. All right. Okay, now now I get the flow of the game. All right. Nice. I don't want to do this for the rest of the stream. What? Bruh. I'm trying out this indie game right now because the developer was like, an indie developer was like, yo, I want you to review this game. And I'm like, um, 
I'll look at it and I'm like, hey, I'm doing a live stream tonight. I'll play it on stream. And they're like, perfect. So possible new video topic. I don't know. I think it'd be fun to start a series where I analyze indie games that developers themselves tell me that they want me to review because I think it'd be kind of funny.